and then go to Tim. David, uh, Hurt was kind of having his way with you guys, and then you get put on him. What were you able to do to slow him down? Uh, I know he was killing us when he caught the ball uh, close to the basket, so just working my butt off to front him and make sure that he didn't touch the ball was pretty big key, and coach putting me on him, really got to step it up. That means that uh, he's really killing us, and notice that half of his points in the first – Half of the team's points in the first half uh, came from him. Tim? Yeah, David, kind of a follow-up on that. Had, had you had any uh, sense that you were going to end up on him the way the game was going or uh, even in uh, practices uh, in anticipation of that possibility? Uh, I anticipated it, but usually the coaches, uh, we – don't really plan for things like that. And when things like that happen, you just got to be ready on your horse. And tonight was one of those nights. As a follow-up, you, you give up four inches and about 25 pounds to him. What, what was the toll there? I mean, how did you hold up? Uh, you just got to stay low in a stance and just be ready and aware. I mean, he was, he could have caught the ball at any point on the course of so just staying alert and matching his intensity was a really big key. Thank you. Any other questions for David? Uh, go to Michael. Hey, David. Michael McCann, my Cardinal Authority. Had lost two in a row. How big is it for you guys uh, to get a win uh, today to kind of snap that skid? And, and what, how does it impact your confidence? Well, it's a huge confidence booster. We can build on it. Uh, we're, our team's been uh, improving in practice, and it's starting to show uh, playing together, especially our defense, and now we could just focus on going forward. Anything else for David from anyone? Tim, go back to you. Yeah, David, you're, you're known primarily for your offense, uh, but this was a, a pretty significant defensive effort tonight. Is that a, a part of your game that maybe is underappreciated or that over time that you haven't appreciated as much as maybe you do now? Um, I just I feel like our slow starts have come from just like everybody really focusing on the offensive end. And I feel like if I can set the tone for the team defensively and get guys going and really pressure and get out in passing lanes and stuff like that, loose balls, just the small things just to get keep the energy up will really help our team going forward, and I feel like it did. Last question for David from Kent. Yeah, David, I, I know Malik is still a little ways away from being able to come back and, and play, but, you know, at least in practice, he's walking around without the boot and stuff like that. Is it is it better seeing him getting closer for you guys? Uh, it's exciting. <laughs> I mean, you love to see guys like that, and time has flew by. He's getting closer, and – it's kind of putting confidence in other guys and bringing our team spirit up. So we're excited for his return. Thank you, David. Uh, appreciate it. Thank you. Uh,